today's the day of the bookshop crawl, so we're gonna go to the breakfast club to uh, get some food, and then we're off to go to as many independent bookshops as possible. Our first stop is the Brick Lane bookshop on, as you might have guessed, Brick Lane. Uh, we haven't bought anything here, also they haven't been able to locate the stickers. Now we're getting on the bus, because this stuff is too far to walk. We're switching for Brick Lane and we're heading to Hackney. No, we're not. We're heading to Victoria Park. at Victoria Park Books, which you can see right here. Again, they didn't have the stickers, but we got a custom stamp, so it's okay. This is near Victoria Park. It's a really cute children's bookshop. Uh, and now we're gonna head north. Second bus, we're now on our way to the pages of Hackney. We're here, and they're closed, but just for a bit. They'll be back soon, is what they promise on the door. We are here at Persephone Books. The Folio Society bookshop was closed. Also, the lady that worked there was like, super nice. There's such a nice, like, quiet atmosphere in the shop. Would highly recommend. Marion's given up. She's on the floor. I need to sit. Do you have books? Junkie by William S. Burroughs. Hello, we are now at Scoop Books, which is a secondhand bookshop, and they had stickers. They have really beautiful walls of like blue and orange penguin books, uh, all secondhand, really good. We're at the London Review Bookshop now. We've been walking and walking, and we've made it, and I've heard there's cake here. Cake would be good. I don't even like cake, but it's sitting. <laughs> <laughs> <I'm> sitting. <laughs> It's the end of the bookshop crawl. We've been out for like seven and a half hours. So we're at Foils and it was beautiful inside. So nice, we have to go. But now we have to go home. And when I get home, I will show you all the books that I bought. But for now, yeah. goodbye. Goodbye. Okay, so yesterday I mentioned that I would show you the books that I bought during my crawl, so here we go. The first one I got was Northanger Abbey by Jane Austen. This is a new edition by um, Vintage Classics. The inside of this is really cool as well because it has a cool pattern and this pattern is then on the outside of one of the other books, etc, etc. Then at Persephone Books I bought Miss Ranskill Comes Home by Barbara Euphen Todd. The description of this is what got me. It is about a lady who has been on a desert island for three years and then she comes back around I think the Second World War and has to adjust a normal life and it is also a uh, satirical novel. So all these uh, books from Persephone books kind of have a grey outside and then a really cool pattern on the inside which is different for every book. Then I have Gone Girl by Gillian Flynn. I've kind of been resisting reading this for a really long time, but now that the movie is coming out, I figured it was time and also I need this for a video, which you will see soon. Same goes for Serena by Ron Rash. I bought both of these books at the London Review bookshop, by the way. This is also being made into a movie, so you'll hear more about this soon. And that was it. I kind of only bought four books, even though we did go to seven different bookshops. I'll put information about all the bookshops that we went to in the description. I hope you enjoyed this bookshop crawl video and I'll talk to you guys later. Doei!